Alright guys, hello, uh, this is John here, and I'm going to be teaching you how to fix your black screen on VNC. So, uh, <coughs> this is on the brand new, the latest updated one, and I uh, got it, it was a pretty cool app, but every time I opened it up, all I saw was a black screen, I know a lot of you have been having that same problem, so uh, today I'm going to show you how to fix it. So you're going to have to first jailbreak your iPod and have Cydia. You don't need install this, you just need Insidia. <coughs> so, uh, this always takes a long time to open up, but uh, once you open up that, you have to go to your manage, which is uh, the section there that looks. There you go. You can see manage. So, uh, manage, and you go uh, sources. Okay, so this is the source that you're going to want to have here, HTTP, well, that's already put in, but then you want cydia.myrepospace.com forward slash rats9 forward slash. I'll have the, uh, I'll have that in the description, but uh, that's what you're going to use to connect to v VNC, and that's what's going to fix your, fix your black screen problem. But before you do that, you must go into the, your directories and delete the current program that you're using. So uh, you're going to still you're going to stay in sources. We're going to wait for this to reload the data. But uh, then you're going going to go into this one here. It sounds like an onion, I think. I don't know what the uh, I don't know what the picture is there, but it's called Telesforo Tangelo. So you're going to go into that. Scroll down to the V section. And you should see VNC with a green check mark on the right hand side of it. Uh, you're going to hit that. Here we go. Now it's uh, updated. So you're going to go down to V. I just have to click V here. And uh, I've already deleted mine, but it'll be. See this right here? This VNC. Um, that will have a green check mark to the right of it if, it's, if you're using it currently. But. Uh, in order to get the black screen away, you have to click on this. Uh, and then you're up here, right hand corner, where it says install, it will say uh, edit or uh, remove, something like that. Hit edit, then hit remove. So uh, after you've done that, because that's, if you don't do that, it will, when you download the new one, it will try to overwrite it and it won't work at all. So uh, you delete that and then you respring. And now you go into your rats 96, which will show up after you add it in a source. So you're, you're just going to have to click on that. Scroll down to V. It's not very big. It's, it's the last one. Uh, click on it. It should say VNC fix. And then hit uh, add. So once that's finished, you got to respring again. And that's all you have to do to fix your uh, black screen. 